just means there might be a cap and growth. But in terms of size, I know a business isn't fun. It's just shy of a billion dollars in revenue. But because of the nature of the, of the very massive products they make, if you want to truly want to scale, and that company that I'm talking about, their competitors are... Check this out guys, this video is called The 7 Life Cycle Stages Every Business Experiences and it's really good, it's found on YouTube, it's only about 40 minutes long, super informative and actually really, really, really funny because Les is an amazing speaker, um, but very informative. 2016 will be a big year, I'm excited for it. Still taking the fat burners guys, morning time. Cheers YouTube lad. Put in the warm ones, take out the cold one. Should probably, there we go, that's better. That's what happens when you whip the door shut too hard. <laughs> Everything tips over. Another one. Yeah, definitely will not be needing that monster that I grabbed out of the fridge. The fat burner is kicking in nicely. Uh, the fat burner has a lot of caffeine in it, obviously, as all thermogenics do, but it also has ingredients in it that basically mimic the effects of ephedrine. Um, it's not ephedrine, obviously, and it's not going to come up in a drug test as any sort of banned amphetamine like ephedrine, so don't worry. It's safe, it's legit, and it's allowed in every federation, but... Uh, yeah, they did a very good job formulating this one because it feels amazing. I feel energized and euphoric to say the least. I still don't know the name, the name of it, but when it comes out in 2016, obviously I'll let you guys know. And I think you guys will love it as much as I do. I can't even listen to that line without laughing anymore. After all the posts and finds and memes that have come out from that. I'm gonna order Gucci flip flops for Cabo in tribute to that song. Dead sirs. Time to tan yet again in prep for this photo shoot in two weeks. One on one advising. Small class sizes and courses taught by professors. It's a vibe. Oh baby, DHL truck is here. Woo, more stuff. I think I remember what these are. Woo, man. This basement's getting stacked up. <laughs> I got these big boxes stashed down here as well. This is only about half of everything. Like I said guys, 2016, I want to be the start of a brand new chapter for me. I want this thing to be big and I'm really, really excited. I'm putting everything into this. I think my first big chapter was NWB, it was YouTube, it was creating what we have today. And from NWB, from that first chapter, I've branched off into a lot of cool opportunities, clothing lines, sponsors, traveling, all that you know, really awesome stuff that I'm blessed and I'm grateful to have done. I would like this project, to not just be a branch off of that. In fact, I, I'm gonna separate it from NWB. I plan to reach outside of the fitness industry into a whole different industry with this and make it separate from myself. And I really want this to be the next big chapter of my life. Of course, you guys are my family. You guys are the reason I'm here. You guys are everything. So I'm gonna share everything with you when it's time. And I'm gonna give you guys first access to obviously everything. But uh, yeah, man, I've been putting a lot of time and a lot of effort and a lot of money into this. I just gave you guys an idea. I've invested about $10,000 into all of this so far, and I've been planning this out, mapping it out, strategizing for at least half a year, if not closer to eight months to a year now. Um, it's been a big project in the works, so we're getting there, guys. We're getting there. I want, I want this to be ready by about early, early 2016. That's why I'm so excited for 2016 to come. <sighs> it's scary, man. I'm not going to lie. Anytime you venture out, into territory that you're not familiar with. It gives you this do or die kind of feeling. And it's terrifying, it is terrifying. The idea of how overwhelming it all is, the idea of how easily it could all fail and be a waste. But man, you just gotta do it, just do it. Fear is the number one cause of failure or, or failure to even try, I should say. Whew, just wanna share that with you guys. I'm sure we all feel it. I wanna share that, we all feel that, everybody. 
It is also very exciting though, guys. Keep in mind, what you think is what you manifest, and I believe that a thousand percent. So whatever idea or dream you have, no matter how big or small, whatever it is, keep it in your head and believe that it's gonna happen. Picture it already happened and stay with that thought no matter what. Hello. Hello. That one just came in, it's very good. Oh, awesome. <laughs> just this morning. Beautiful. So I got Ari Roses and her favorite candy, Reese's Pieces, and I'm about to go visit her at work. I haven't seen her in a good like five days or more, and it's been pretty much my fault. I've been in tunnel vision this last two weeks of the shoot, just dieting, so I've been staying at home, and she's been slammed at work and with her own training. And when she gets busy like this, usually I go to her house when she gets out late at night, but just because I've been dieting and whatnot, I've been basically just staying in hitting my calories and going to bed if, if I'm not training or doing cardio. So she's been putting up with me like a champ lately. I'm grateful to have a very supportive girlfriend like her during this. So just going to stop by. I'm going to get food at her work and uh, I'm going to surprise her with these roses and Reese's, Reese's Pieces. You Instagramming it? Yeah. <laughs> I'm surprised you didn't film my uh, reaction when you came in. Nah, because I wanted to be in the moment, babe. Aww. What did you think? Are you happy? Yes, I you had know, no so you, idea. You can keep me for like two more weeks, right? Yes. I extended my lease. <laughs> this is amazing. I might need to get another one. Everyone in the kitchen knows it's your order. They're like, that's a strange order. And then when everyone's like, yeah, it's for my boyfriend. They're like, oh, I figured. <laughs> Round two. Round two. Yeah. Thank you. Uh, Ari said I look small. Yes, you do. <laughs> yes, I don't like it. It's weird. Because I've been no carbs. I know. It sucks. Oh well. 13 more days. I know. Ariana's mad that I didn't, I didn't vlog her note. Let me see it. Why are you running away now? Show me it. Because I didn't even realize I wrote it at the bottom. It's, it's adorable. This and be and I got the drawings. Thank you, babe. That's so sweet. second draw. Ooh, we are on a roll today, guys, with this new 2016 plan. Look what else just came in the mail. Just got home to find this from Ink File. Woo! That is officializing this business. Netflix and chilling while I digest food. I came home, had that chicken, just had uh 135 grams of white rice just a carb up because i gotta go get update photos for isotory and i'm incredibly flat right now deep into the darkness on netflix it got terrible ratings <laughs> but the picture looked really cool in the front of it and i don't want a movie that like i get really really into right now since i have to get up and go to the gym soon i just wanted something that was entertaining that I could kill time with what's going on guys so here's a sneak preak of a sneak preak. Ah, a sneak preak. You know Rack I love South Park. Um, this is a sneak peek of an upper body session that I got done that I not only made progress in strength in, but also in physique. In this session here, I managed to press the 110 pound dumbbells for three sets of eight, which is way better than what I was doing a few weeks ago, and at a new low body weight of 170 pounds on the dot. And my physique really transformed even since the last update that I showed you. Like I said, these last couple of weeks, guys, uh, there's gonna be changes made almost daily to my physique because it's, it's down to the wire now. So I got a little physique update and uh, a cool upper body workout in. But if I showed you all this footage, in this video, it'd be like a 20 minute long video. <laughs> and I don't like watching 20 minute long videos. I like 10 to 15 minute long videos at most. So um, I will show you guys this footage in the next video. I wanted this video to mostly be about uh, the theme of everything we talked about earlier. But this sneak preview is just to show you that <laughs> there is more workout footage and physique footage coming. I'm not neglecting that. <laughs> Thanks for watching guys. Just got back from a late night gym session. Chickens in the microwave. Just had my post-workout shake, but I realized I'm out of my diet soda. And we can't have that during crunch time of this diet, so 
Gotta go to the store and get more diet soda right now. Got my flip flops on. Anything cherry. Oh, perfect. Oh, cranberry is close enough. And it's caffeine free. This is perfect.